What's up mga Padres? Welcome back to our channel again. This is Mike of So Padres and today we are back with another special sneaker unboxing video. And by the way, for those of you who are new to this channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button. That will help us uh, a lot. And here in So Padres, we do sneaker unboxing videos. Hopefully soon, basketball shoes performance videos. We also do toys and collectibles unboxings and reviews such as uh, Funko Pops and McFarlane toys. So as you guys saw uh, in the title of the video and the thumbnail, we got a pair of shoes from Anta, Anta Philippines and this is it. But before we unbox it, uh, I'd like to share the story behind how, uh, how Anta gifted this to us. So uh, one of Anta's uh, Philippine ambassadors here in our country is a uh, veteran actor, idol, Boss Boom Labrusca. Uh, one day I was scrolling through my Facebook feed and I saw uh, Boom Labrusca's uh, post about him and Anta giving away a pair of shoes and then I uh, decided to check out the mechanics because of course as being a sneakerhead and being a Pinoy siyempre pag free uh, these are strongly uh, intrigued me so the mechanics was or the example was to send him a message on why you should receive or be gifted a pair from Anta Philippines I decided to join and uh, I sent a boom a message uh, about my brother's story basically I told the story of my brother about him being a former basketball player who played in multiple schools uh, namely St. Joseph's College, Coleo de San Lorenzo Ruiz, De Los Santos STI. He was also selected to be lined up for San Beda, Team B and JRU NCAA Team A but sadly that didn't push through as well as San Lorenzo NCRAA Team A College and he also was lined up for uh, Quezon City selection uh, all, all, all collegiate players in the QZ plus he was also uh, part of the training team of Happy uh, the Lamoyan franchise team in the PBL in the early years of uh, his career so uh, part of the message I sent Boom was uh, about my brother uh, succumbing to injuries well no, no major injuries but he became sickly due to gout. He had to retire from basketball at an early age. Labas pasok siya sa hospital. I think he was in a wheelchair for around six six months straight. Bedridden for a few months. Paulit ulit, magre-recover onte. Bedridden ulit. Tapos sa he lost all muscle tone. Tagasin parang naging may polio yung legs niya. So it's been quite a few years since he, so he's been able to do even uh, just a tiptoe. So this year, even if may pandemic, he's been working out, uh, following a strict diet. Now he can jump even uh, na mababa and then tuloy-tuloy lang yung pag-gym niya. So I told uh, Idol Boom the story about my brother about his road to recovery. Uh, I mean, he's already 36, 37 now, uh, definitely won't be going pro. But it's all about uh, getting back on track with your life, being to able to get a job, live longer, stay healthy, become healthy, and kasama na rin dun yung pagbabalik sa basketball even if it's just recreational play na lang. Hopefully, syempre, of course, after the pandemic. Just like Anta says in one of their slogans, it's the care you need to bounce back. So it's perfect for my brother because the models of uh, or endorsers of Anta is 
Gordon Hayward and Clay Thompson. So, si Gordon Hayward, as we all know, suffered a terrible uh, injury na lumabas yung buto niya sa shin niya, uh, season opener against LeBron. And then, of course, Clay Thompson who injured his uh, ACL. And then, while coming back, tore his Achilles. So, still is trying to get back uh, to play for the Warriors. And, yun. That's it. Yun. Comeback talaga. Comeback is real. Ika nga. Hashtag. So, yun. I sent my story to Boom. And then, soon enough, I was added to a group chat with the other winner. Two winners to, by the way. With Boom, the other winner. And then, a former courtside update. And uh, I think a reporter now. Uh, Miss uh, Roxanne Monte Alegre lose. So, in the GC, it was announced that I was one of the winners. So, uh, I was really ecstatic. They gave us the mechanics on what to do to claim our pairs. I claim ko na yung pair at the Atrium Mega Mall uh, Anta Store. So, with no further ado, let's uh, unbox the shoe. Ayan, really nice Anta paper bag. So, as I mentioned earlier guys, uh, the giveaway was actually for my brother. But stay tuned, I'll tell you more kung how it happened or how this pair or this exact or specific pair ended up in my size. So stay tuned kung ano nangyari, kung paano nabigyan ng Anta Shoes yung kapatid ko and then kung bakit naging para sa akin to. So, let's open it. Oh, and by the way, meron din siyang socks. Part of the mechanics was you you go to the store, you select which store where you were, you will be redeeming the or receiving the the giveaway, and it's worth five thousand of uh, merch based on a suggested retail price or SRP, not the markdowns. Cause uh, when you get to the st store, I think it's still sale up to June 20, 40, 50, and 65 percent off. Sobrang bank your back, tapos sobrang sale pa. Sobrang mura. Mababa na SRP, laki pa ng sale. So, sobrang panalo. So, guys, visit na kayo dun. So, pagdating dun, um, I was excited to select a pair of shoes for my brother. However, uh, and I'd like to uh, state a disclaimer, this is the only downside or the only negative thing that I can say about Anta is their sizing. Not just me, but other known shoe tubers as well have been saying this about the brand that uh, medyo may pagka sila pagdating sa sizing and I found it out to be true for myself. Uh, my brother is a size 13 to 13.5 pagdating sa Nike and then pagdating dun, I straight away asked uh, which uh, which shoe, which model or what shoes uh, were uh, included in the 5,000 limit and which had 12.5 uh, because uh, apparently the biggest size that Anta has is 12.5 and specifically in the store they didn't have any other models that had 12.5 and none of them had 0.5 so walang 10.5, walang 11.5 walang 9.5 so sa other other signature lines other models ano lang 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 tapos for uh, only one model had or only one signature line had 12.5 uh, which was the Clay Thompson line the newer versions and the older ones which all had a uh, retail price above 5,000 so walang 12.5 or walang shoe na magkakasya sa kapatid ko dun sa available for the giveaway. So, medyo natagalan ako mag-isip dun kung anong gagawin. So, finally, I decided to get the giveaway for myself and support the brand by purchasing a pair with my own money for my brother. So, it ended up like a trade. For this video, this review, this will be for the pair that I got for myself. And then, Stay tuned, magkakaroon tayo ng another video for what Anta Shoe did my brother receive. And as for the sizing, I mentioned na 13.5, 13 to 13.5 siya. For the specific shoe that I got him, ang recommended is go down half a size. For this one, uh, it's true to size. So, ito na 
siya. Lalabas na natin sa box. Tabi muna natin itong socks na 395 pesos. Oh, I forgot. Let's take a look at the box. Ayan. I saw in other color, uh, the other colorway, the green and pink one. You had the black box with text specs here. I'll insert a picture of that in the vid. And here, you can see that, guys. It says basketball shoes, art number, color, official colorway, silver, gray, and black. Made in China because this is Chinese brand. Size 11 and for the upper it says mesh, synthetic, leather, and TPU. It's basically plastic. Outsole, molding, EVA, and TPU. So I'd also like to mention that I was really shocked with this uh, shoe which is Anta Shock the Game 4.0. The Rise of the Anta brand na parang dati pag sinabing Anta nung panahon nila KG and uh, Rondo is parang medyo pag hinawa ko may shoes nila it kind of felt like a you know like a knockoff shoe like a fake shoe but now nakapag-purchase ako and nakasuot ako ng Anta na brand uh, I'm really really I'd say I'm really really impressed and I'll be definitely copying more from there in the near future Sobrang ganda, sobrang quality niya and sobrang bang for your buck. So simula nung nag-sign nila si Clay Thompson, doon na, doon na nag-boom yung brand nila and yung shoes. So, moving on to the details and the tech specs of the shoes and, and the materials. So for the tech specs, of, I think the main highlight of the shoe is uh, the A-Shock. A-Shock Foam 3.0, which is, can be seen here, it's labeled there. And of course, the A shock stabilizer, which is this part. So I've tried on these shoes. I uh, will really insert the B-roll later on. Uh, it's really super bouncy, especially in the heel, which is a ton of heel compression and has a good amount of court feel in the forefoot. So um, this stabilizer reminds me of two uh, nine-piece uh, basketball shoes uh, one is the monkey po from the the Nike GP Gary Payton and secondly the Reebok so this uh, stabilizer is really uh, somewhat of a genius uh, design because it's, uh, it's instead of a usual torsional bar that's in embedded in the shoe like usual na mga shank plate dito ganyan siya from here eh, from he this part from the bottom rolls up to the side so wala talaga siyang tapilok yun sobrang okay siya for torsional rigid rigidity and support and then what i can say is uh, hindi tinipid yung shoe no weight reduction feels like a I'd like to say it feels like a Nike or and or an Adidas shoe. Sobra, this brand really shocked me na sobrang ganda niya. Going up to the to the uppers. Uh, we have here mixed materials. Uh, this I think uh, part of the torsional uh, torsional bar. The a shock stab stabilizer is uh, I think this is TPU. This part, it's plasticky part. And then for uh, for this part, it seems to be this is the synthetic leather part. Synthetic siya, pero makita mo may tumble details. So, nice touch and really soft. For other uh, colorways, I think in the green one, nakita ko synthetic suede to eh, pero look real too. So, it's a iridescent color. And then for this part, for the upper, it has textiles, open cell mesh. And then for the back part, it's a, so I think it's micro-molded mesh. And then for the tongue, ito, lambot, tapos super breathable siya. For the tongue, it's micro-molded mesh, which is uh, super padded. Ayan, so ito, yun, iba-ibang layers ng ano. Ito, tong gray part, parang ano siya, overlay style siya. 
Tapos on foot it feels like a woven Sobrang ganda ng pagka quality ng mesh niya And then for the laces Ito para siyang rope laces And then for the tongue You have this uh, really nice pull tab With Chinese characters on it And I think this is the The model's logo uh, I'm not really sure What uh, this means uh, If you know guys Feel free to comment down below And then Meron siyang parang nunal na 3M And then another dark iridescent part Or glittery part That's dark It's the pull tab Really nice pull tab here With Chinese characters Again if you know guys what that means Please feel free to comment down below And then for the Ankle part Really nice sculpted and gigantic uh, Ankle pillows Which really sucks, sucks your uh, Heel into the shoe na walang slippage talagang lock in ka talaga so for support uh, and lockdown sobrang panalo to as for the traction it has a really nice hard rubber with a blade type traction pattern uh, which really I tried this uh, in our house on our floors and uh, it's really squeaky and has a really really hard bite and I feel this uh, this will uh, last you Plus, you guys, a uh, good amount of time, even if you play on outdoor or indoor courts. And uh, also, this is specifically designed for outdoor. So, either way, use it indoor or outdoor, panalong panalo siya. Kasi mura and maganda. Sobrang comfy. You can grab this at Antam Atrium Mega Mall for around 2,200 pesos only. So, going back to sa, sa sizing, uh, I still recommend going through to size. For this specific model, uh, like I said earlier, sa kapatid ko, he needed a 12.5, which will be covering in another video. But for this for this shoe, yun nga nagturo na ako ng mga gusto kong shoes, and then wala masadong stocks available for this, kasi in my size, kasi yun nga marami rin bumibili dun dahil sobrang baba ng presyo. Mayro sila mga ibang shoes like 1,700, 1,800. Tapos ito, tuto na lang. So, being a natural 10.5, mamimili lang ako eh, kung 10 or 11. Magpipiliin ko ba yung masikip na 10? Or may allowance na 11? And anyway, hindi rin naging available yung 10 for me to try out. So, nung sinabi na merong 11 for this one and then I tried it, naramdaman ko rin na Sobrang ganda ng paghug niya sa foot So even if may allow one thumb of allowance dito sa dulo And syempre libre naman Choosy pa ba ako? Yun Ito na ang pinili ko And then I feel that even if uh, medyo one thumb yung allowance niya I still can uh, definitely play in it uh, Of course once the pandemic is over Yun, hopefully, yun, soon If you made it to this part of the video, sobrang thank you for watching all the way for all our supporters. Sobrang thank you for the love. 
And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment, and hit that notification bell. And again, thank you to you, uh, Boss Idol, Boom Labruska, and also to Ma'am Roxanne Monte Alegre Luz. Thank you to Anta. Thank you to Anta Philippines. Sobrang appreciated namin magkapatid yung bigay nyo. Me and my brother, we promise to work hard. I know my brother will work hard to on his rehab to get back in shape, get back on track, bounce back sa life niya, sa physical uh, fitness niya. And syempre, I, uh, to my subscribers and you guys, I promise to give my all. Me and Vaughn and Kat to give our all uh, in providing you quality vlogs and videos dito sa channel namin. That's all guys. Peace.